Have you ever pondered upon how a war, seemingly short-lived on the scale of history, can shape the trajectory of international relations? The Sino-Indian War of 1962 is a testament to this very thought. A month-long war, yet its reverberations can still be felt today, over 60 years later. In the early years of the 20th century, India and China were two nascent republics, fresh out of the clutches of imperialism. They were neighbors sharing a vast border, but their relationship was marred by a lack of clear demarcation. It was this ambiguity that led to the first spark in 1959 when India granted asylum to the Dalai Lama, the spiritual leader of Tibet, a region China claimed as its own. This action was perceived as a direct affront to China's territorial sovereignty. The undercurrents of discontent escalated, culminating in the Sino-Indian War in October 1962. The war was swift and brutal. China launched a two-pronged attack on India's northern and eastern borders. The Indian army, ill-equipped and unprepared, faced heavy casualties. The war ended as abruptly as it had begun, with China declaring a unilateral ceasefire on November 21, 1962. The aftermath saw China in control of Aksai Chin in the west, and parts of Arunachal Pradesh in the east. These events were a turning point in Sino-Indian relations. India, having trusted in the hindi Chini Bai Bai, India-China Brotherhood mantra, was caught off guard. The war exposed the chinks in India's defense and led to a major overhaul of its military strategy. China, on the other hand, emerged stronger, solidifying its position as a major Asian power. Yet, the war also isolated China internationally as many countries sided with India, viewing China's aggression as a threat to global peace. Now, let's take a step back and summarize the key points. The Sino-Indian War was a result of territorial disputes and political tensions, exacerbated by the asylum granted to the Dalai Lama by India. The war was swift, lasting a mere month, but its effects were extensive and long-lasting. India was forced to reevaluate its military strategy, while China solidified its position as a regional power, albeit at the cost of international isolation. Thus, the Sino-Indian War, although relatively short, has had a profound impact on the geopolitical landscape of Asia. It serves as a stark reminder of the long-term consequences of territorial disputes and the importance of diplomatic resolution over military aggression. It's a chapter from history, yes, but its lessons are as relevant today as they were over 60 years ago.